Hello, I'm Kanchana. I work as a senior information developer for BMC Software. In this video, I'm going to show you an overview of key performance indicators or KPIs and how you can configure these KPIs for CMDB. The CMDB dashboard is a visual indicator of the overall health of the CMDB at any given time. As a configuration manager, you can configure the integrity and completeness KPIs to monitor the health of the CMDB. The integrity KPI captures the often CIs and duplicate CIs in a data source. You can use the completeness KPI to see if a CI has missing attributes. Let's see, see how you can configure the KPIs. From the CMDB UI, go to configurations, configure dashboard parameters, configure dashboard and data sources. You can see the dashboard configuration parameters. On this page, you can choose the classes that you do not want to include in the KPI's calculation. For the integrity KPI, you can configure the classes to be excluded for processing instances for duplicate CIs or often CIs. Expand this box to view the complete list of classes that have been excluded. Similarly, for the completeness KPI and data sources, Overlay datasets are excluded by default from processing during the data sources utility run. This helps to save processing time while processing large datasets. Let's now see how we can configure the attributes for the completeness KPI. On the CMDB UI, go to configurations, configure dashboard parameters, configure completeness. On this page, you can filter a class name and select the class for which you want to define the attributes for completeness. If any of these attributes has missing values according to the priorities defined here for completeness, the CI is considered as incomplete. You can change the priority of these attributes. Two or more attributes can have the same priority. You can add your own attribute for this class that you want to consider for the completeness calculation. Click Add New Configuration. Select an attribute and assign a priority to it. Save the configuration. You can delete an attribute if you do not want to consider it for the calculation. These changes will take effect when the dashboard utility runs the next time. Now, let us go back to the dashboard and see the impact of these configuration changes on the health of CMDB. As you can see, the integrity metric shows the classes that have been excluded for processing. It also shows a number of CIs included in each of those classes. Similarly, for completeness. For, under the data flow section, you can click data sources to view the details of the classes and CIs that were excluded for the calculation. Do check the BMC CMDB documentation for detailed information about the KPI calculations. Hope this demonstration was useful. Thank you for watching this video.